How did a distinctive farming and, <coughs> and industrial economy take shape out west in the late 19th century? Well, the, of course, the conquest of the far west was one of the dynamic uh, economic processes of the late 19th century. And I'm talking here about places like Colorado, Nevada, uh, Utah, places like even uh, California, large parts of it. Uh, these areas had not been very thickly settled before the Civil War. Um, now they are penetrated both by farmers and by large-scale industrial operations, mining operations, lumber operations. The West, in myth, is the home of the rugged individual, the self-made man, the pioneer. In fact, it's the home of large multinational corporations, or now it's national corporations, railroads, mines, etc. It's the home, increasingly, of large-scale farming, bonanza farms, etc. It becomes more and more difficult for individual farmers and individual uh, workers to, make, to, to really carve out a life of autonomy in the West at this time. 